Hey, what's going on? Uh, I'm Dan Gamash, and we're going to talk about home warranties. In the Tri-Valley, uh, it's standard that in the purchase contracts, the buyer asks the seller to pay for a home warranty. It's a one-year warranty that covers uh, plumbing, electrical, some appliances, your heating and air conditioning. Um, but and then they have different levels. They have a comprehensive, and then you can add pool and refrigerators and washer and dryers. And for the most part, they're okay. Um, they're obviously a business. They're in it to make money, and they were a lot more lenient up until 2008, when uh, things slowed down. They had to cut what they cover, what they don't. So, for example, a client of mine had a furnace go out. Well, it was an old furnace, and it wasn't up to code. So. You know, they have a cap of $1,500 for a furnace. So they basically, it was the best investment for that client of mine just to take the $1,500. But at that point, you know, they, they would uh, basically cover the unit, but they won't cover, uh, you know, throwing it away or code upgrades. So those are f expenses that go on uh, to the homeowner's uh, side. So... I think they're great for if you're going to get the seller to pay for them. Uh, if you're going to renew them, I don't think it's worth the money. I think that uh, they're cutting angles and um, they are looking for less to do and more to charge, uh, just like any business. So ask the ask sellers to pay for them and uh, ride that one year one year out. Hopefully, you won't have any issues. If you do um, get the most out of them you can and then once that one year is up just you're better off without them I feel. Um, if you have any additional questions you can reach me at 925-918-0332 or take a look at my website trivalleyhomesearch.com. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.